YouTube, welcome back to another video. Today, I will show you how to download and use the newly released Nezor Vi 2. First, head to your browser and type in nezor.net. Now, at the top, you will see Download V2 Beta. Click on it. Once you download it, drag it to your desktop and extract the files. Now launch nezoloader.x. Click yes to the admin prompt. It's going to launch a tab where you can get your key, follow the link verti steps and get a key. Let's say it wasn't that easy and you ran into some problems. Examples could be DOL problems or SSL connectivity related problems or even unable to find Nezo problems. Not to worry, now I'll be showing how to fix all of these problems. For the Net Desktop Runtime error, click on Yes when it pops up. Once you're redirected to the site, click the first download link. Download the file and then launch it. Click Install and wait until it finishes. Click Yes to the admin prompt. Now close out and try launching Nezor once again. There we go, one error down. The next error is the SSL connection error. On top of that, the can't find Nezor error is also common. Both of these are really easy to fix and only require the usage of a VPN. First, close out of the error and launch your VPN. I use Proton VPN. It's completely free, and my previous tutorial shows how you can download it. Now launch Nazur again and everything should load perfectly. Keep VPN on. The new UI looks amazing. Launch Roblox and go into your game of choice. I'll be showing you the best Arsenal config. Scroll all the way down to where it says Colorbot. Now go into your Arsenal settings. Graphics. Set enemy outline to on. Set enemy outline color to blue. Now return to the Nezo UI. Click the Start button and then press F5. Once you load in, turn the aimbot on and off using the Shift key. In V2, it doesn't lock onto your teammates like V1 did. The color aimbot has a built-in trigger bot that shoots as soon as it spots the enemy. Please note that V2 is still in beta and won't work as well as it will in the future. V2 is constantly getting worked on, and if you'd like to find more info, join their Discord, link in description.
All right, you two, that will be all for today's video. If you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. For more help, leave a comment. Goodbye.